Hello, I'm Mark Fernandez. I'm the principal investigator for HPE Spaceborne Computer 2 at Hewlett Packard Enterprise. It's a super edge computing. We currently have Spaceborne Computer 2 on board the International Space Station, proving out the value of edge computing. The massive amounts of data that are generated on the space station by scientists and engineers and other experiments, we can process that and minimize not only the time it takes to get the results back to Earth, but the amount of data that you have to send back. So the, the secret sauce is that it is a team collaborative effort between edge computing and cloud computing. At the edge, we process the data down to the minimal insight that needs to go to the end scientist on Earth or to the cloud for further exploration. And so it's a collaborative balance of processing. Yes, indeed. So Spaceborne Computer 2 is shown behind me, and it's relatively large. With Spaceborne 3 and further, we'll have more compute capability in one-fourth the size. So that's very exciting. Uh, it's standard x86 computers. Uh, our mission was to take state-of-the-art, off-the-shelf processors and computers that any HPE customer could buy and get them to the space station, to the edge of the edge. The idea is that you develop here on modern computers. And oh, by the way, when you get to the edge, you're going to have a modern computer there to run your software on. So we monitor the power. Uh, we minimize it by monitoring all the components and running them at the minimum needed to achieve the goals. I find this one extra exciting, particularly with our partner Astrolab here. So we're currently on the edge of the edge on the space station. That edge is moving out to the moon in 2026 and we want to be there. I began in 2014. So, uh, it's going to be my lifetime career. I think when we land on the moon, I'll be happy to retire. <laughs> <laughs>